Good evening to you. We start tonight with breaking news involving the Lexington Parking Authority, the agency responsible for operating Lexington's parking meters and garages. As WKYT investigates started asking questions, the Lexington Parking Authority Board now admits that years of mistakes involving fines for parking tickets on expired meters happened. WKYT's Miranda Combs is at the live desk now following this breaking story. Miranda? Yes, yeah, Sam, as you well know, this story is about four years of overcharging some drivers who receive parking tickets in Lexington. After someone tipped WKYT to the problem, we filed these open records requests to track down answers. Lexpark said they were working on our requests. Between 2008 and 2012, Lexpark says it made a clerical error. That error meant some drivers ticketed for parking violations received $15 fines for late payments too soon. We started asking questions to Lex Park's executive director, Gary Means, and late this afternoon, the board's chairman stepped in. James Fraser said only one type of violation out of 35 potential parking violations was impacted. While he said there have been no complaints, clearly the right thing to do is to refund the money that was prematurely collected. But here's an issue we're still asking for answers on. Lex Park's board said it just recently was made aware of this issue. This 2012 email from Lex Park's director documents how he knew about the problem then. Means called it a major issue and was looking for answers about how to deal with the issue. That was almost three years ago. Now Lex Park's board says it was just recently told about this problem. At the live desk, Miranda Combs, WKYT. Miranda, thank you. And while the chair of the board says only one violation was involved, for four years, those fines for the expired parking meter amounted to more than $1 million. Of all parking violations from 08 to 2012, the expired parking meter was at least 50% of all the tickets written.